John Gary Steele previously shared that production on The Big House had started. Now Outlander fans who haven't read the books want to know what's so important about it. The Big House will be featured in Outlander Season 5. John Gary Steele previously shared that production on it had begun, making it clear that this part of the books was sticking around. Of course, those who haven't read the Outlander books now need to understand what the house is and why it's so important. I shouldn't need to say it but I will, there are spoilers from the fiery cross and beyond in this post. This house is something that even the non-book fans will have heard about. It's all about that obituary. When Jamie built the cabin, it was only a shelter. With the small size, there was always a plan to start working on a bigger house on Fraser's Ridge. Work is started two years after work initially was started on the cabin. It takes time to build this house. The timing of the build has changed in the series. It actually started before going to search for Roger to rescue him from the natives and drums of autumn, but hasn't started being built yet in the show. However, there's likely to be a very easy explanation into the reason for the big house being built. With Roger and Brianna now together and heading to the ridge with their son and Marsley and Fergus on their way, the cabin is going to get extremely cramped. This causes problems in the fiery cross, but the big house is closer to being built. We'll likely get to see more of the arguments that could happen as a group of people live in such a cramped space. But how does it connect to the obituary? Well, this is the house that goes up in flames. Does this mean Claire and Jamie are going to die? Do you really think there's a full story without Claire and Jamie? What is so important about the big house to you? What are you excited to seeing in Outlander Season 5? Share your thoughts in the comments below.